Today we are going to learn about an exciting phenomena. Most of us had seen rainbow, right? I guess no one will be there in this world who doesn't like to see rainbow. Actually, if you ask me, I'll say rainbow are most romantic god's creation. But is there any science behind it? Yes, there is. We have already learned white color is a constituent of seven different colors. But how does this white light of sun split into various colors of a rainbow? Before we take up this question, we shall first go back to the refraction of light through a prism. The inclined refracting surfaces of a glass prism shows an exciting phenomena. Let's try to find it out through a small activity. Take a thick sheet of cardboard and make a hole or make a narrow slit in its middle. Now allow sunlight to fall on the narrow slit. This gives a narrow beam of light. Now take a glass prism and allow the light from the narrow slit to fall on one of its surfaces. Now turn the prism slowly as in the light which comes out of the prism should appear on a nearby screen. What do you observe? You will find beautiful band of colors. But how does this happen? The prism has probably split the white light into band of colors. The sequence of the band of colors that you can observe will be violet, indigo, blue, green, yellow, orange and red. The band of the colored component of the light beam is called as spectrum. You might not be able to see all colors separately. Yet something makes each color distinct from the other. The splitting of light into its component is called dispersion. So can you guess how rainbows are formed? Yes, it is by dispersion. Let's find out how rainbows are formed. You might have observed rainbows are normally seen only when it is raining or right after rain. What happen over here is the water droplets act like small prisms. They refract and disperse the incident sunlight and reflect it internally. And finally, it again refract when it comes out of the raindrop. This is the reason why we see rainbow opposite to the sun. Here in this lesson we have learned about rainbows and dispersion which are some of the exciting phenomena.